Tian Xuesen, born in 1911 in Shanghai, was a pioneering Chinese aerospace engineer and cyberneticist. He played a pivotal role in the development of both American and Chinese rocket technology during the mid-20th century. His expertise and groundbreaking research would eventually make him one of the most influential figures in the history of modern rocketry and space exploration. After earning his engineering degree from the National Chiao Tung University in China, Qian pursued graduate studies in the United States. He obtained a master's degree from the Massachusetts Institute of Technology, MIT, and later a doctorate from the California Institute of Technology, Caltech, where he studied under the renowned aerodynamicist Theodore von Karman. At Caltech, Qian became a key figure in early American rocketry, co-founding the Jet Propulsion Laboratory, Chai. JPL which was instrumental in advancing rocket science and space exploration in the United States. During World War II, Chan's research significantly contributed to the development of American missile technology. He was involved in classified military projects, working on the theory of jet propulsion and guided missile systems. His expertise in supersonic flight and missile design made him highly valued by the U.S. military. However, during the 1950s, amid the height of the Red Scare, Qian faced allegations of communist affiliations. Despite a lack of concrete evidence, he was placed under house arrest and stripped of his security clearances. After years of legal battles and diplomatic negotiations, Qian was deported to China in 1955 in exchange for the release of American prisoners held by China. Upon returning to China, Qian's expertise became a cornerstone of the nation's missile and space programs. He led the development of the Dongfeng ballistic missiles and the Long March space rockets, earning him the title Father of Chinese Rocketry. His work laid the foundation for China's advancements in space exploration, including the launch of its first satellite and the development of manned spaceflight capabilities. Qian's influence extended beyond rocketry. He made significant contributions to the field of engineering cybernetics, helping to shape various scientific and engineering disciplines in China. His theories on systems control and automation influenced not only aerospace technology, but also the fields of computer science and military strategy. Despite opportunities to return to the United States after the normalization of U.S.-China relations in the 1970s, Qian chose to remain in China. He dedicated his knowledge and skills to his homeland's technological and military advancement, becoming a key figure in China's rise as a global aerospace power. Qian's work directly influenced China's successful manned space missions and the establishment of its permanent space station. His legacy continues to shape China's strategic ambitions in space exploration and missile technology. In his later years, Qian remained a respected figure in the scientific community, mentoring a new generation of Chinese engineers and scientists. His vision for China's technological independence became a guiding principle for the nation's space and defense industries. Qian Xuesen passed away in 2009 at the age of 97. His legacy as a scientific pioneer and a strategic mind continues to influence China's aerospace endeavors and serves as a testament to his profound impact on global space exploration.